Five loaves minus 5,000 people. That should equal zero, right? That's basic math, but Jesus operates in a different equation. After the crowd eats, after thousands of men, women, and children are completely full, the disciples count what remains, 12 baskets, more than they started with, way more. A boy brought five loaves and the disciples walked away with 12 baskets each. This is the economy of the kingdom and it shatters every single spreadsheet that you've ever made. Giving it doesn't subtract, it multiplies. Offering it doesn't empty your hands, it fills them. And here's the word that really got to me. The Greek term for leftover is parisima, and it doesn't mean scraps, it means surplus. It means overflow, embarrassing abundance. And Paul uses this same word when he writes, quote, God is able to make all grace abound to you so that you will abound in every good work, end quote. Abound, perissima, God math. So that thing that you're clutching because you're terrified to run out of it, remember the boy handed over his entire lunch and he walked away more fed than when he arrived, and so did everybody else. That's not coincidence, that's, that's kingdom economics, and it still works today. Friend, I'm Adam. If you enjoy this content, please do subscribe onward, and God bless you.